right, uh, welcome back to Morning Express. It is time now for Friday Chat. And uh, this time we're talking about fashion for sport. And we're talking about the Barclays Kenya Open, the 49th edition of the tournament will be taking place from the 26th, 23rd to the 26th of March this year at the Mudaiga Golf Club. The tournament will be expecting about 10,000 uh, people in attendance, among them golfers, elite golfers from across the world. But what do you wear when you're attending a golf tournament? So in studio with us to discuss fashion for sport is Nailante Kenga, who is the commercial marketer for Carol Mandy Media, I believe. <laughs> Head of marketing. Head of marketing, Carol yes. Mandy Media. Thank you so much for joining us on Morning Express. You're welcome. Very pertinent topic we're talking about here, fashion for sport, because many times you do not know what to wear exactly. to any of these sporting events, especially for sports that border on lifestyle, something yes. like golf, Yes. right? Yes. So talk to us about the Kenya, um, Kenya Open uh, Barclays uh, tournament from the 23rd. What should Kenyans wear? Oh, interesting. Uh -huh. um, I think, first of all, the weather is very hot right, right now. Um, so obviously, people must wear something that is comfortable. Mm -hmm. And um, I'll start with women. You know, first of all, you must wear something that is not, um, when I talk about shoes, don't, talk, don't wear stilettos. Wear shoes that are comfortable. You can wear flat shoes or wedges. Um, when you wear your makeup, make sure you wear your sunblock mm -hmm. or sunscreen. So that you know you're going to be in an open air. Um, you don't want to be wearing too much makeup as well because then it will look a bit uh, funny messy, right. and messy yeah. as well. And floppy hat, uh, sunglasses will make you look as well. So it's not very, just sport; it's yeah. fashion as well. Yes, so exactly. We have a few pictures on the screen there. Just talk to us about what they're wearing and how how, how appropriate it is for a golfing event. You see, um, the lady, she's wearing a hat. You can see she's also wearing uh, the jumpsuit. She looks amazing. So block colors are amazing. Uh, the guy's wearing a hat, and he's also wearing a suit um, that is also comfortable. But you don't have to wear a suit mm -hmm. uh, to this event. We're, we're, we're encouraging people to wear uh, more linen for men and loafers, something that's more comfortable, khaki pants, um, shorts for men. Mm -hmm. That is a lot more comfortable for them. Sunglasses and a hat as well, right. um, for men especially, mm -hmm. yeah. But what, yeah. Of, what of those, some of us are just attending the event as spectators, we're not playing any sport. Yes. So why do we need to be so sporty? Um, you don't want to look out of place. This is a golf tournament. You want to look part of the event. Um, you can't be wearing stilettos. It's not a fashion event. Uh -huh. And that's why for True Love, we partnered with Barclays mm -hmm. to make sure that we encourage uh, spectators to come and attend the Barclays Kenya Open. It's going to be fun. It's going to be interactive. It's going to be big. They will have a playground for children as well. So uh, we want it to be fun. We want fashionistas to attend this event. And that is why True Love was very much involved uh, in this Barclays is Kenya open and we want people to look good mm -hmm. you know uh, to wear the best outfits and that's what I'm saying you know um, come wearing your beautiful outfit block, block uh, colors are much, we encourage people to wear block colors mm -hmm. no stripes um, where you have ha floppy hats uh, it looks a bit different it's not part of what you would see in a golf, in a golf event, right? Exactly, exactly. You know. Also, do your pedicure look nice? Uh, you know, I mean, I'm seeing these guys uh, like the guy on the on, on, on air right now. He's wearing a, a jacket, and um, you know, the shoes don't look very sporty, if you ask me. Uh, the guy on the screen right now, he's wearing a suit and a tie. Is that really conducive for a sporting event? Okay. I wouldn't say what he's wearing, you should wear everything that he's wearing. For example, you can't wear the tie, but it's high fashion. Mm -hmm. That is high fashion, which is still, you can still pull it off, um, but you don't have to wear a suit and a tie. But if you're very high in fashion, you can, like you can see, he, he's managed to pull it off very well because uh -huh. he looks very nice. He's wearing loafers, he's not wearing socks. Um, the pants he's wearing is not, it's not your normal office official suits. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. So uh, are guys coming going to be featured in the uh, True Love magazine for Certainly, their fashion Certainly, we're style. going to spot who's best dressed. We're going to give them prizes. Uh, we'll have uh, makeup 
guys do makeup for people on the day as well. Uh -huh. So it's going to be fun, it's going to be beautiful. We're gonna take pictures, post on social media as well. Um, so people must attend this Barclays Kenya Open. I'm so excited Absolutely. about that. Absolutely, and the tickets, how much are the tickets? The tickets are going for a thousand shillings mm -hmm. and um, those are season tickets and per day it's costing 500 and we're giving out uh, three tickets. To all yes. viewers this morning, yes. absolutely. So if and you're watching Morning Express well. on a Friday, chance you stand a chance of winning three tickets to the Barclays Kenya Open Tournament, which will be taking place from the 23rd to 26th of March at the Mudaiga Golf Club. About 167 elite golfers from across the globe will be attending this tournament. All of them will be competing for the top prize, which is 30, 32,000 euros for the golfing tournament. But of course, this is not the only event that will be taking place other than golf. I understand there will be other things as well, um, probably horse racing, um, horse riding, potentially. On the day, mm -hmm. on the day it's going to be just golf mm -hmm. for the day. Right. Um, but we'll have hospitality tent uh -huh. where people can have entertainment. You can bring your kids. Um, and there's going to be a lot more activities at the hospitality tent. That's why we're encouraging people to come and enjoy themselves. Come with your friends, come with your family, come and have a good time because it's going to be fun. But look good, mm -hmm. look comfortable. Um, and make sure your kids are also looking comfortable as well. Actually, we're going to talk about kids and hair in just a moment. But if you want to win the ticket for the Kenya uh, Buckley um, Open, do tweet us under the hashtag Morning Express KT and tell us why you should win that ticket. Three tickets are up for grabs. So let's talk about children. What should children wear to a golfing event? Same as what you would wear. Comfortable shoes, khaki pants. I'm encouraging people to wear linen, comfortable uh, and more plain colours. Uh -huh. um, they stand out because you look like you're in sync with what is happening um, at the event. Yeah. All right. And yeah. then, of course, hair. Hair is another thing. Because uh -huh. uh, with, with ladies, we don't really know what to do with it. So you can wear hats, as the hats you've talked about. But do you let your hair down? Do you let it open? Do you braid it with African hair? You can wear a fascinator, you can wear a floppy hat and your sunglasses and wear makeup, you know, wear a pop of colour on your lips, you know, so that you look beautiful and nice, but not heavy makeup mm -hmm. on the day. We don't encourage... We, you need to look as natural as possible, but part of the event as well. You know, you need to look comfortable right. and beautiful as well. We also encourage if you're wearing dresses, wear strapless bra so that you're not showing your bra um, if you're wearing a, a strapless outfit mm -hmm. as well. Ah, so we talked yeah. about the do's, what to wear to a yes. golfing yes. event. What yes. should you absolutely avoid? Oh, no jeans. And really? I mean, jeans, 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 <laughs> jeans are the first go-to go item when you're going no, to a sporting no, 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 event no, no. for this, both men and women. No, no, no. No jeans and no Arsenal t-shirts, no Manchester t-shirts, <laughs> please. Please, let's keep those away. We shouldn't be wearing those. No heels. Yeah, because yes, obviously so uh, you'll be on the course and it's, it's you, I mean, it's going to be digging on the, on the ground as well. So we prefer that you wear wages. Uh, the jeans is definitely flats. a shocker. Yes, no wages. I mean, sorry, no, 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 no jeans. Mm -hmm. So the men just khaki pants? Yes, khaki pants, linen, um, proper trousers, you know, shorts, khaki shorts as well. Even for women, mm -hmm. you can pull that off as well. Right, yeah. tight clothes for women? If it's comfortable. If it's comfortable and fashionable, and you can wear sneakers as well. People pairing outfits, dresses, and sneakers, and you look very nice. Uh -huh, that's something, because um, that's actually on one of your pages. Yeah. This is a True Love uh, yes. magazine. Yes, it, it, exactly. It's become a trend now, wearing uh, dresses with the sneakers and exactly. shoes. Yeah. Um, it, and Kenyans are beginning to embrace it. It looks very nice. It looks very hot. I would wear that, because uh -huh. it's comfortable, it's nice, it's funky. I'm not having to strain... Um, being on the on the course because I have to walk up and down. So yes, you must uh, if you can get sneakers as well. Yeah. I yeah. Mean, do you think Kenyans have embraced this? Uh, you know, dressing appropriately for specific events. No, they have not. And that is why we are here today, so that we can help Kenyans dress appropriately for the Backless Kenya Open. We want them to look nice, we want them to look hot. They need to pick their tool of copy and see what we've done in this issue. In the fashion pictures, it looks amazing because mm -hmm. it gives you ideas on where so you can buy. So this magazine focuses only on uh, sports, how to dress exactly. for, for sports. Exactly, specifically for the Backless Kenya Open. That's mm -hmm. why we had this um, fashion images in this issue for to love for the Octo um, for, sorry for the match issue right so they need to pick it up and make sure that they get uh, an item or two from the stockists you know um, and get to know where to uh, buy these outfits right well. and you've talked yeah. a lot of uh, colors and color blocking yeah. but uh, most golfers mm -hmm. wear white 
all white. Yes. Is that recommended? It's recommended, obviously, because of the weather. Mm -hmm. And um, sometimes it depends with what they've agreed with the team. You know, if you're in a team, uh, what am I supposed to wear? But it's also comfortable because of the weather. Most of the time, they're outdoor. It's hot. So it you know, white is a lot more appropriate than wearing black or any other color. Mm -hmm. Yeah. All right. So we're giving three tickets out to our viewers this morning, but also other than three tickets, you're giving subscriptions. Yes, we're giving what? two love subscriptions as well to our to your viewers. Um, three subscription for six months. Six months for yes. the True Love magazine. Yes, exactly. All right, so exactly. three people now stand uh, to win a subscription of the True Love magazine for the next six months. And if you're a fan of True Love, like I am, I'd probably jump on this. In fact, if none of them take it, I'd probably sign up for that subscription <laughs> subscription myself. So do talk to us. Morning Express KTN is the hashtag. Tell us why you should win a ticket to the Barclays Kenya Open Tournament and why you should win this six-month subscription to the True Love magazine magazine, the, this month's magazine also focusing on what to wear to a golfing tournament that will be taking place at the Mudaiga Golf Club from the 23rd to the 26th of March this year. All right, Nylon Tay, so let's focus on closing comments. Shoes, we have talked about no heels for the women. Yes. So if you're not wearing jeans, are you also wearing sneakers? Sneakers you can wear, because mm -hmm. um, obviously it's a sport event. You can wear sneakers, but you need to pair it well with what you're wearing, with your outfit. That's why I said, you know, if you're a lady, you can wear a beautiful skirt or a beautiful outfit with your sneakers. Preferably if it's short, it looks really, really nice. Mm -hmm. Above the knee, it looks amazing. Right, uh, open yeah. shoes, For sandals. Women. No, sneakers, <laughs> no, please, not on all you know, When it's a sunny day, yeah. uh, the first thing you want to wear is a sundress and just nice flip-flops and walk No flip-flops, please, because you see, also you are outdoor and you're walking on grass as well, so we prefer that you don't wear open and flip-flops. No, 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 right. no sandals, yeah. Right, yeah. okay. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for coming to us on a Friday chat, and I learned to you, Kenga, is uh, the head of marketing at uh, Carol Mandy Media, the uh, company that uh, produces a True Love magazine, and they are now offering three tickets to the Barclay Kenya Open uh, from the 23rd to 26th, and also three subscriptions for six months to the True Love magazine. So do hit us up. We'll be reviewing your comments already. Uh, some of them are coming in here. So we'll be reviewing who is most suited to get this subscription, and uh, we will be giving you a call later on. Thank you so much for coming on Morning Express, Nailante. Thank you for having me. Thank you. All right.